Hello, this is Ivy from CrossConnect. Hi, this is Annie from CrossConnect. Okay, so today we'll talk about some questions we will get from our customer. Okay, so let's start from the patch core. Because some of our customers will ask us, uh, how do you run the test for a patch core in your factory? Uh, yes, usually we suggest to do a patch core by component test. Because component test label patch core can fit all the channel environment. Okay, yeah, so we suggest to do the component test. So Ivy, can you show us how to do the component test? Okay, so in our uh, mass production, we will use the Fluke network test to run the cable test. And uh, I will demonstrate uh, how we run the patch core test. Mm -hmm. Okay, so before we start, we would like to show you the uh, interface of the cable analyzer. Okay, so in our production line, and we will use the flow test to run the test. So the model we use is the latest one, DSX8000, and we also have 5000 in our production line. So before you start the test, you have to uh, check the adapter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very important. Yes, if you to run the K6 patch core test, you have to install the right adapter on the machine. Okay. So we were going to select the cable type first and also the test standard. Okay, now we are going to show you how we do the K6 UFTP patch code component test. First, must make sure the adapter is correct for K6 patch code. And then we will set up the cable type. So choose the edit and choose the right cable for CASIS UFTP and choose the test limited okay we set up the patch code for TIA patch code CASIS 1 meter so now we start for the test Okay, so we got the test result. Next is 3.2 dB. It passed the component test. Okay, now we are going to demo the CAT6A UFTP patch code component test. So first, please check the uh, test adapter is correct for CAT6A. And then we are going to set up the cable. Choose the cable by CAT6A. CAT6A UFTP cable. And test the standard, choose ISO patch code, test is A. Okay, now we got the test result. Next, 3.5 dB, it passed. So we are glad to share with you how we do the component test today. Hope you like our information. Follow us on YouTube or LinkedIn. Thank you. Bye-bye.